Howdy, howdy. Uh, I'm back at it again, hitting my little field, and I'm just going to show you around. And I'm just going to hit this field hard. I've been here about 30 minutes, and this is what I just dug up, if there's anything to it. I have no idea inside of it. It's got like a square piece and on the top like all kinds of rivets and stuff I don't know if it was a piece of a rivet button or what I don't know but I'm just gonna keep on digging maybe I'll find something good today all right stay tuned all right guys I'm back and it looks like I found what's left of a thimble not much left of it it was crushed I cleaned it up but yeah that's what's left of a thimble it looks like stay tuned all right I'm back and this time I found a weedy the 1919 Weedy. Alright, just a 1919 Weedy. <laughs> I'm kind of happy right now. Something I just dug up. I haven't dug up in like, I don't know, a couple years. But uh, hey, check this out. I just dug me up a uh, large scent. This is my second one ever. 1851. Nice. Here's the, the back side, the reverse side. Now that is pretty nice. Eighteen fifty one large scent. All right, I'm tickled. Well, let's keep on digging. Okay, guys, just dug another rivet, as you can see. <laughs> All right, just dug a rivet. Stay tuned. Okay guys, I'm back and I found a B and L button. Crown brand B and L button. Not too old. But uh found a button. <laughs> B and L. Like a B and L snap button. But anyway, alright, let's see what we can find next. Stay tuned. Alright, I'm back and I just dug another large scent. But this one is too far gone. This is my second one out of this field today. Too bad it's too far uh, toasted. Alright, second large scent. But no date. Yeah, that's a pity. Alright, y'all stay tuned to what else I can find. All right, I'm back, and this time I dug. Looks like a pretty good sized flat button that broke on me. That's pretty cool. What kind of flat button is this? Anyway, nice little flat button. Two pieces. <laughs> All right, let's keep digging. Nice little, well, not little, pretty good sized flat button. Stay tuned. Alright, I'm back. And I uh, switched back to the stock coil. About, I don't know, there's a truck. And I went about 10 feet. 10 to 12 feet. And there's the hole I dug. 
and I just dug a uh, V-nickel. I just switched to the stock coil on the AT Pro and I dug a 1902 V-nickel about 12 feet from the vehicle. <laughs> That's pretty cool. 1902 V-nickel. Stay tuned. Still using the stock coil for the AT Pro. Dug my hole. Look at this. And I thought it was a flat button. All it is is a shotgun shell. Ah. <laughs> Just a shotgun shell. Let's keep on digging. Look at that. Can you tell me what this could be? It looks like it could be a, a bicycle chain link. What do you think? Looks like it, doesn't it? All right. Looks like I found a uh, bicycle chain link. I don't know what else I could find. No telling. I'm going to keep on digging a little bit longer, see what else I can find. So stay tuned. Okay, guys, just a couple days later. I'm in my other field today. And I just dug like a piece of a gear. See that? What was this? <laughs> It was like it was a piece of a gear, maybe. I'm not sure. But anyway, all right. Okay, I'm back with another target. And I just dug a little flat button. It's got some kind of writing on the back side of it. It's got a nice shank. Here's the top part. <clears throat> it might have had something on the top part but I don't know but I can't make out the back of it maybe when I get home I can wrench it off a little bit or do something but it's got some writing on it it's a nice little flat button all right let's keep on digging all right I'm back and it looks like I found some kind of button. There's the top piece. And here's the back. Oh, hold up. Top piece just fell off. Alright. Some kind of two-piece flat button. So like the shanks broke off. Top fell just fell off. Came apart. Alright. A two-piece button. Stay tuned. Check out this uh big piece of chunk of lead. I believe it's lead. Sounded pretty good. <laughs> Alright, big chunk of lead. Stay tuned. All right, I'm back, <clears throat> and I found it's like part of a back of a button. All that's left is this little piece and the shanks on it. I searched the hole <clears throat> and around it, nothing. So, all right, just a shank of a back of a button. Okay, I'm back, and I just found me a it was like a four-hole button. I took the brush and cleaned it. <clears throat> Got all the sand out of the holes. So it's a four hole button. First time I ever found one of these. I think there's writing. I don't know if there's writing. It looks like there's writing on this side, but maybe not. Found a four hole button. Pretty cool. Never found one of one of these before. Alright. A four hole button. Hey, check this out. I just found this. Looks like a lion head. And right there it says on. That probably said lion. 
or maybe not. <laughs> But anyway, it's pretty cool. It's like a lion head to something. The rest of it broke off. It might have been a pin. All right, stay tuned. I think I'm calling it quits. Going home now. Um, I just want to tell everybody. And I hope everybody have a good Thanksgiving. Uh, good luck and happy hunting.